In this video, we're going to take a look at the Advertisements section within Google AdWords. For each campaign, you are provided with a load of information about how your campaign is performing, and it is very important that you understand what is being displayed and what it all means. So let's take a look. If we move down the screen a bit, you can see the advertisement we created earlier. You can see the details of the advertisement and that it belongs to an ad group called Cheap B&B. So if I was running advertisements and trying to track people that are interested in Cheap B&Bs, I might have multiple advertisements which I could then split into ad groups. The advantages of ad groups is that it enables you to define and control certain settings for all the advertisements within an ad group rather than having to define them for each advertisement in turn. The status is eligible, which means it is an, an approved ad by Google. Percentage served shows you out of the total advertisements that are served when people run searches, what percentage is related to this advertisement. Clicks shows how many times your advertisement was clicked on. So every time someone clicks on your ad, you have to pay. So if people are not clicking on the advertisement, there is some issue with it. Impressions shows you how often this advertisement was displayed. CTR indicates the click-through rate for your ad. The click-through rate is based on how many times the advertisement is actually displayed. So if it's displayed 100 times and two people click on it, that gives you a click-through rate of 2%. The higher the click-through rate, the better for you, as it's one of the key factors to determine the quality score of your advertisement, which we're going to cover later on in the video. So make sure your click-through rate is high and always look at ways of improving your ad to keep on increasing it. Your average CPC, or cost per click, is how much it costs you on average for each click, and the cost column gives you the total cost for this ad so far. Now what we also see here is the average position. This is the average position of where the advertisement will appear. As we haven't run this ad yet, you'll see it is at zero, but that is important in terms of what position it is generally displayed in. Now let's take a look at the keywords for this campaign. Click on the Keywords tab and you'll see we have a list of all the keywords for this particular advertisement. We can again see what the cost per click is, what the impressions are, the click-through rate and so on. However, the only difference between the information you see for an ad and the information you see for your keywords is the quality score. Google rates advertisements based on a quality score from 0 to 10. The higher the quality score, the more relevant Google thinks this advertisement is based on what people are searching for and the keywords that you specified for your advertisement. Google then rewards you with the lower price for, for each click. So it's very important to increase your quality score. One of the key factors that determines your quality score is your click-through rate. So if you display your advertisement 100 times and 10 people click on it, that's a 10% click-through rate. This is considered quite high, which means the advertisement is very relevant to what people are searching on. So make sure that you get that quality score right.